What's good? It's Marcel J, curator of Good Vibes and Good Music. Back at it again with a new reaction. I'm, I'm like low-key a little sad to do this one. I'm excited about the artist. It's Noah Cyrus. She's just talented as fuck, beautiful as fuck, cool as fuck. She's just, a, she's the type of, I, I, I hate that I keep saying pop star. I've been saying pop star so much in the past week, but she's the type of artist that I love to see in 2020, like a young artist thriving in, She's just so talented that I know that she's gonna get even better in time, in time and like, just give us mind blowing albums and all of that. But I've been wanting to react to her music in a, for a while. And uh, yeah, I've wanted to react to her music for a while, but I thought that there's just so many choices. But right now my mind is thinking about, don't know, she did a cover for Mac Miller's song that was off his last album, Swimming. Don't know, and it's it's a beautiful song with Mac, and it's a beautiful song with Noah. And I just wanna, I just wanna hear it, reflect on it, and vibe out with it, vibe out to it with you guys. Since long since, no no breaks. So without further ado, let's get into it. This is Dono, Noah Cyrus, another fight. These ads. Whenever the song started, whether it be Noah's or Max, it always shifts my mood a little bit. Like, I, I love the song to death, but like, I always get a little bit sad because you can't help but think about Mac and like the masterpiece of an artist, of an artist that he is, but the masterpiece of an, of an album that he created before he passed, like. Shout out to Triangle Park with the production. It's it's extremely minimal. It's <sighs> there's like a, there's a warmth to it, and it's it comes from a lot of places. It comes from the way that the songs like produce and the beat and all of that, but also by the voices with Noah and Mac. There's just some type of just this loving warmth about them on Mac's side about him just. Just confessing his love for a girl who is just beautifully reckless in his eyes. And then Noah, like when I think about the song, I like, yo, I'm like, yo, this is Noah. It's it's not specifically Noah when it comes to Mac, but like Noah is a type of girl that Mac was singing about on Don't Know. And it's just dope that they put or that she put two and two together. It was like, yo, this is a song that I relate to, I feel. And that I would sound good as fuck on, so like, why not do a cover and celebrate Mac? Ah, I love, I love the way that sounds. Oh, it's the edited version. Mac has a very dope, amazing way of telling stories and his songs and being very descriptive and the imagery that just pours out of this song whenever I hear it, especially with the original Dono. With Mac's version, there was no video. So like, I remember hearing that song and just being like, yo, I can picture this girl. I feel like we always, we all have like ideas of celebrity wise who the girl could be, but it doesn't have to be that. It can just be this, it could be that friend, that friend who's just the life of the party and who's full of energy, full of life, but at the same time is behind closed doors, 
is going through things who's super emotional and um you just want to care for her you want to love her you want to protect her but like at the same time she feels like such a like a bad bitch she has that energy where like you can't tame her you can't contain her and you just you watch her you watch her sword it's it's oh, i hear i think it's so many things when i hear this song and when i when i hear max music you Yeah, wouldn't you rather get along like why do we have to argue why do why do we have to make things so difficult for each other you know until, until it is no longer let's get lost inside the clouds and you I thought the bridge was coming, but that was the vocals. Like this isn't even the best example of what she can do with her voice. Like she has so much emotion, so much power and control behind what she says. And she has the type of voice where it feels like she's lived so many different lives and she's experienced so many things. And I know like she is young, but she is, she has gone through a lot in her, in her lifetime. So the pain does come from somewhere. But I just think about like, yo, the amount of music that she has in her that she could, that she's gonna make and release to the world. It's it's a blessing. It's it's, it's amazing to, it's amazing to witness as a fan. I was busy when you hit my phone. But you This song, man. I'm always taking too long. Baby, we don't need a trip. We could be right here. When the get away, we could switch up gears. I wanna see the lips kiss from ear to ear. I wanna hear your song. Oh, I wanna feel just how you feel. Touch you one more time so I know you're real. We could spin that wheel. Wouldn't you rather get along? Until, until there is no longer. Oh. Noah. Noah. Oh my god, Noah. I I just keep thinking about the other I, I would make this a longer video, but I can't and I won't. But I keep thinking about like July and Topanga and the end of everything the liar and go like she has so many amazing songs and i don't think she's getting the recognition she deserves just because she's i don't know i'm not gonna say she's under miley shadow anymore but it's just she isn't a mainstream like super mainstream type artist to me for to me in my opinion like we do have like artists like SZA, um who am i like benny unconventional artists that are winning right now but at the same time they're not like top top billboard charts and all that um i don't know if no one wants to get to that level or if that's like whatever it, but it's just i want more people to hear her music and just feel feel what feel how feel what what happens when you listen to her Let's Here's the bridge. Come on, give it to me, Noah. I think we just might be alright. Thank God. I think we're gonna be alright. Alright, okay. Ah, <sighs> yo, hearing because I now I'm thinking of Mac and his song. It's like, yo, I'm so happy for the people who find someone to love on that level and who impacts them in a way to create something as beautiful as this. I, I hope that everyone gets to feel that. I hope I get to feel that on a level one day. 
Um, but yeah, it's just, it's so beautiful to hear. I never get tired of it. Oh, the strings, the strings at the end. single every single time i hear the song whether it be the cover or the original it hits me like this like i act like a weirdo just usually if i'm in public i'll keep it to myself in my head but <sighs> fuck i love mac i love noah this is my reaction it's an amazing song i've just fucking melted in front of in <laughs> i'm just fucking melted in front of the camera so you know how i feel about it uh, let me know how you feel about don't know and the cover and if you're for or against it because i know some people are just like no don't touch max music like whatever it is but i i hope that people will appreciate that noah appreciate mac and that she was inspired by him and she sounds good on the song like point blank period uh but that's my reaction if you enjoyed it make sure you give me a thumbs up make sure you subscribe to the channel new videos coming out every week and i'm i'm trying to go hard with creating dope entertaining things for people to watch and have conversations around and with with me comments I'll, let's talk uh so hopefully you guys enjoy it but on that note i'm gonna go day drink with a friend so cheers see you guys on the next one